Lining up the kick for the Cavaliers, that is Lucas Lorenz. And there's your kick, it's a bit of a squib kick. It's going to be picked up by the second line there. It's brought down quickly, that was number 20 of the Tigers. Here they come out, one, they got one in the slot. Kurtz in the backfield, quarterback, and he decides to run out the middle. He's got some space, dropped out very quickly. In the shotgun, he takes the snap, runs it on the outside. It's an end around. He goes up through the C gap, gets just sandwiched. And that was so now third down and two, 2.45 to play here at the beginning of the game. First quarter. Still in the shotgun formation. He has three to his right. A lot of running here. A lot of formation. This is going to be close. Quentin Duncan back to punt. Fourth and two, we're gonna have a punt. Can't get the punt. The guys who catch the punt out. It's up, pretty good punt. It's gonna be grabbed at about the 20 yard line and here come the Cavaliers. Oh, a little hurdling move. He's got some space. Uh, he could go. Touchdown, get it. Oh, and they're gonna grab him right at the 35. Under center, Ron Colley, two in the backfield. They hand it off to Dalton Cox, four under center. Man in motion. Big handoff, it's a bootleg. Tigers all over, they smell it. Under center, gonna go for it at fourth and two, you're down this close. Probably too far for a field goal. Cox in motion. The bootleg out to the left side. Straight out the pass, just out of it. Nice three down stop. And stopped him several times, all the way from second down and four. Just oh. did not let them get across those sticks. And for their second offensive set, last time just didn't go too well. And we'll see what they can do second time around. Man in motion, they give it to the back, coming out of the outside. Good fake so far tonight. Listed as a running back, but he's doing some of the uh, quarterback duties. Now they actually turn it over to their other quarterback who bootlegs out the right side. He's looking for something. Oh, and he just did. In the shotgun. Two back, two receivers on each side. For Rosso, he decides to air it out, turn it around. Oh, and a great comeback play. Something in the water out here in Groton. There's the snap. QB calls his own number and he's met by a whole host of Cavalier tackle. The shotgun, one in the backfield. Three receivers to the right of Rosso. One to his left. Ron Collar right to 4-2. They do a screen pass out to number 21, Mason Madsen. Shotgun. Rosso, he's got trips to his right, two to his left. Ronald yelling plays from the sidelines. Oh, that's gonna be a they are to go back to the shotgun formation. Rosso still facing that 4 2 defense. He's going deep. Okay. He's got L. That one's a win. We got a punt by the Tigers. They opt to uh, just get rid of the ball here with five and six left in the first. Trenton Duncan back to kick for the Tigers. A little bit of a short. Here come the Cavaliers. This is group of the last time. From their 36th line. One push under center. He's got two backs in the backfield, one in the slot. They handle him up the outside. You see a lot more of him being a lead blocker tonight, but so far we haven't. Now in the backfield, Lucas Lawrence. The two receivers each side. Oh, there's a ball. I'm calling 40 yard line, first and 10. 
Rosso, he's got two in the backfield. Holmes, the lead blocker. Oh, that's nothing happening there. In their own territory, they got to step it up. Still running at 4-2. We got four receivers in this set, three to the right. Some odd start time. There's a pitch outside. Pretty decent run. Rosso's under center. He's got two in the back. He's bootlegging out to the right. He's got some defensive men on his tail. Zero zero. Cavaliers and Tigers. Not it. At not it. There's a pitch out in the backfield to Jackson Godin. He's got some new blockers. Really the low 80s right now. Getting close to high 70s. So very nice conditions right now. Second and six. A little high snap from the pocket. Rosso airs it out. He's got his man. Here to play in the first. Hold is down, the kick is up. So now with a 7-0 lead, the Tigers kick off. Back to receive is Lane Holzer and Dalton Cox for the Cavaliers. It's a very high kickoff, it's going to be fielded about the 15. Lane Holzer, he's going around the right side. Oh, he's got some room to run. It's a good block up field. He's got the 50. Hey, new life breathed in him here. You see, he thought Grogan maybe taking some wind out of their sails there. It's Dalton Cox laying in motion. They hand it to the up back, and he fumbles the ball. Now Lundquist is back in shotgun. He's got three receivers in his left. He's looking deep as well. He says, you can do it, so can I, but he just overthrows. One of your big conference rivals. That, that's really hard to do at the same time and be successful. Man in motion. Matt Swallow comes across the field. Oh, in the backfield. Oh. Back yeah. to see if the kick that's is safe. Toby Carter, number 32, number 19. Spencer connects. Lucas Lawrence on the punt for the Cavaliers. Oh, a high snap, and it's over his head. And here come the Tigers. Now he's just going to have to run it. He soccer style kicks it and somehow gets it away. Not going to be that helpful. Oh, that's a very, very generous bounce. Rolls. .com. Shotgun two in the back there for Rosso. Takes a couple quick steps. He comes unloaded and just throws over. Here come the Tigers. Second down and ten. Jordan trying to dig themselves out of this hole. Shotgun, three step drop. Oh, connects over the right side. Trips left, one to the right. Here come the Rock Holly defenders. He just barely gets the ball away. Throws it a lot. Cox and Braden McNeary back there. So you go. That's my slow, excuse me. They're screens, I think, too. Cavaliers have a lot of field to make up. 88 yards to Pedro. Right up the middle. Three in the backfield with Lundquist. They hand it off onto the outside. Nice quick little stutter step move by Dalton Cox. From really making any big significant plays, maybe one good pass play, and that's really all we've seen so far. Down under center, they hand it off, there's a fumble to play here in the second quarter. Rosso, quick little jump pass, he's looking into the corner. Oh, Rosso is under center. He hides it, but not too well. Rosso's in the shotgun. Whoa, that's a high snap. Oh, that's good. Uh, just connect. Now they spread out. They really spread the field. They got five receivers out there. So I, I'm just going to guess it's a pass. And he's just airing it out to Riley L. Just happened. Almost a block there Fine. by Ron Keller, but just got in his field of view. And sandwich, then try the August $5 feature foot long Black Forest ham, egg and cheese with spinach available all day long. Only at Subway. Eat fresh. 
Here's the snap and they hand it to Dalton Cox who once again just... Well, Mike Kelly did a nice job of some of that old school smash mouth football that you come to expect from this uh, dynasty of a school. Moving right up the middle. That's number 23. First and 10, let's do it again. Says Lundquist under center, and we got some whistles. I think Ron Cobb. 8.42 to go here in the second quarter. All right. So under center, Lundquist down very low. He got a man in motion. That's Cox. He's going after the left side. And for the up back. Play before the half. Two receivers each side, one man in the backfield. That's where they hand it off to, right up the middle. That's number 23, Lucas Lawrence. He's doing a nice job. Brown is with us. In the shotgun, three receivers to his left. A little bit of a PA rollout. Oh, those picked off by number five, Ryan. Hit roll out. One push decides to air it out. It's not looking very good, but some the ball is on the Tiger 38 yard line. The Tiger defense got to do something here. A little outlet pass over to number 21, Lane Holzer. He's going to be stopped. Four receivers and one on the backfield with one twist. Takes a quick couple steps. He's looking to go deep. Oh, that's a nice spiral. Come on. He's got his man. That's number 32. Max. So after the penalty, the ball is to what? Get it. Tigers hoping to stop this Cavalier charge. Pretty sure they don't know where this one's going. And the one. Three in the backfield. Who's it going to? Sorry. Yeah, you guessed it. Let's go get it. Gun goes to Cox and he crosses the line. Back to Central. He's got a break, I guess. Hold is down, kick is up, kick is. For the American News, so thank you very much, Ryan. I think they've got the games on the uh, computers back there. We really appreciate all you're doing for us back there at the station. So, not up in seven. by number seven, Darren Johnson, for the Tigers. He crosses of the 2012 season here in the Northeast Conference. Tied at seven, good, hard hitting football as they hand it right up the middle. Rosso under center. Oh, that's going to be a little fall. That's going to be a false start. All right, receivers to the right for Rosso. Kurtz in the backfield with him. We'll come back by number 21. Nice and by number Hanson. From the shotgun, four receivers for Rosso to choose from. Ooh, nice snap, but he's able to corral it. Oh, nice job by Riley L. Oh, he fumbles the ball. Be, looks like it, yep, it is picked up by the Cavaliers. Ball out, and all of a sudden it's the turn of events here with three and a half to play. Now Ron Collins takes it. They give it to Dalton Cox again. He plows his way ahead. We're going to at the middle. Oh, it's a one handed grab. From the shotgun, one twist looking to his right. He rolls out. Had a man in his face. Spencer Connect. And Toby Carter back to receive the Lucas Lawrence punt. To the backfield, Riley L in motion. They hand it to Kurtz. One receiver each side. We've got double tight set. Oh, and here comes. 
Once again, the Tigers go to that double set, double tight set formation. They release, but they just go right up the middle again. Receivers to the left, two in the backfield. For Rosso. Pitch in the back, that's number 18, or 16, Jackson. Jackson Game of the week, Will Elkins. Thank you for joining us here once again this season. This game has been nothing short of what it was billed as. And off the coach. Tackle right these are so far tonight. Accuracy, the Tiger punt is number 32, Matt Swallow. That's a very good punt. Tiger side, Lundquist under center. He's looking deep, he airs it just in the middle. Oh, almost. Well, same formation as last time. Lundquist under center, five step drop. Oh, he's looking deep. He's got two receivers. Oh, and it's going to be picked off by number two. Rosso is under center. He's just going to take a knee and run the clock out. So, zero. And Beresford and Sioux Falls Valley are tied at zero in the fourth. This program update was brought to you by CB Operations, where service is part of every deal. Ron Colley set to kick off here. We are still tied at seven here in the third quarter. Ball is just going to be let go out of bounds. Now, I mean, it's kind of a wash, if you ask me. We've had about one guy make a great catch. That was Connect for the touchdown. As they give it to Kurtz right up the middle. He's got some good room to run, and he's going. He's got nothing but open field if he can beat these two players. Their backs against the wall early on. Give the curtain to Wildcat who hands it directly off the number seven. But he finds no yards for the Tiger. Now in the shotgun. Rosso turns and looks to the outside. Nice grab by Mason Matson. He turns it and goes to the Finally brought down at the kick to uh, Spencer Connect for the touchdown of the night. Oh, and messed up with Come the Tigers. We've got five receivers out on the field in the shotgun. Looks to his right. A little wobbler. One twist is in the shotgun. We've got two receivers on each side. Lucas Lawrence moves out. Oh, one twist decides to run it right up the middle. Really not letting too much penetration happen. And they've only got one sack on the night. Oh, Cox is really like giving one twist some time to, to really run this offense from the pocket. So, so far I think Ron Colley's ahead here in the PG game. PA roll out to his right. Oh, he throws a bomb. Oh, just Cavaliers are gonna punch. Carter and Lone back to receive the punt. Carter's gonna take it. He's got a decent block. That's gonna be a block in the back though. We'll be started on the return. Started. First to ten with 8-10 to go here in the third quarter. Around the outside, that's Nick Johnson. He's got a blocker or two, spins around some of the defenders. Some quick line substitutions there for the Tigers, rearranging the personnel. A little pitch out in the back to Johnson. They're calling for the sweep, and he's trying to evade, and he's just not going to work. Tend to play here in the third. A little bit of a wildcat. Kurtz is going to go around the outside. Right along with his lead blocker. McNeary and Swallow back to receive for Ron Collin. Swallow gets it, takes it right in the gut. He's trying to run around the outside. He's got a little bit of space. Goes right in between some blockers, and it's finally oh, really difficult to do in the first game. One push, five step drop. Oh, he is just okay. Shotgun, four receivers, three to the right of Lundquist. Cox and pass to go. A little bit of a pump fake. Oh, he tries. Groden coming up. Four two, about a four two defense. They're really disrupting the backfield. A nice, some play moves yeah, down. Yeah. Connect the target back to receive. Swallow punt. There's a kick. That is a booming kick. 
Oh, takes a very, very pro Ron Colley bounce. Had to turn back around and oh, just gonna be dragged down. No return on the play. Tack bananas, go go bananas over there. As the Tigers are out on offense here for the first time, and actually not the first time, the second half. Kurtz again, some wildcat. They disrupt the play, but he third. Kurtz still working out of that wildcat formation. He breaks through the line this time. Only going to get a couple. The Tigers back deep for some good field position. And the way this game is going, I think the next score is going to win. And back to Johnson. He's running around the edge. Ooh, that's good. Carter's in the backfield. Again, running some shotgun. Oh, he didn't fool anybody on that one. He was just tied for the Tigers. Oh, Carter's going to throw this time. Riley Allen jump pass any side. This time in the shotgun, it was Rosso who finds a, finds a slant route there from Mason. Here's the punt from Groton on fourth and four. And it's a, ooh, it's a doozy of a punt. It'll be about the 40 yard line. They're gonna let it bounce, heads backwards. Ron Colley picks it up and decides to run with it as everybody just kind of fell asleep. One push has Cox in motion. Bootleg out, a throw on the run, just out of. Cox in motion. That's who they pitch out to. Oh, they pitch out to Swallow. Oh, and he's brought down from the shotgun. Three receivers to Lundquist left. That's where he's looking. Again, he. So here we are, fourth down again. Trade offs of four and outs here by both teams. Toby Carter back to receive. Lawrence punt and bounds. Ron Colley's got to be careful. Bring still tied seven apiece. Second and seven here for the Tigers on their own 23. Live sports game of the week. Nailed by a second game of the Hub City Bowl. So out of the shotgun to start the third quarter. Swallow back to receive the punt from the Tigers. There's the kick. It's up and it's another good kick actually. It's gonna roll. Oh, really high. And it's been nothing short of. Under center, Longquist. Makes the call, hands off into the backfield. That's off to Lawrence. Coming out throwing. Lundquist has two back in the backfield. Two to his right, one to his left. And we're gonna have a they get it out to swallow, and he's trying to work his way through. Lundquist looking for a cross route. And he finds his man in 13 between Hilton and I believe it was McNeary. Really got the defense off their backs for that split second enough. But Hilton just couldn't turn up field and get any extra yards. Another very good punt picked up by Sada. He's got some room to run, finally dropped there. I think that's going to be the ball game. Here's the flip outside to number 16. To come out in a pass-friendly formation. Five receivers to choose from for Rosso. Three-step drop out of the shotgun. Oh, he finds number 19, Spencer Connect, and he's breaking the line. Coming off that undefeated JV squad last year. Rosso takes a couple-step drop back, gets it over to Ronnie Allen. It's going to take three guys to bring him. Power eye formation. They pitch a sweep outside to Johnson. He's got some room. He's got some jets, too. So second and three. Again, shotgun for the Tigers. Five receivers set. They throw right up the middle. For two minutes to play. We'll have a couple more scores for you just after this play. Oh, he's going deep, looking in the end zone. Riley L. Oh, just oh, incomplete, and broken up. Yeah. 
Second and 10. Clock ticking, 7.25. Oh, a nice catch right on the fingertip receivers. He finds Riley Allen, breaks the first tackle. There's the snap. PA bootleg, he's looking. He's got some guys in front of him. He's going to be dropped in the backfield. Again, that five receiver set. For Rosso. Oh, he's going deep, corner of the end zone. Hey, Hell's got his man beat, but deep. Good uh, yards after for Madsen and L. Five receivers again. No, he's going deep, the corner of the end zone again. Fourth down. So out of the shotgun. Rosso. Will we see another end of the. Yep, same play again over the corner of the end zone. This time, oh! Out here to throw. We're tied at seven. Thank you for joining us, American News Live Sports. Will Elkins on the call. It's been a pleasure bringing you this game, and we're going to have. It's now first and 15. The ball's now on their own 20 yard line. Out of the shotgun formation. They hand the ball off in the backfield right away. This is the field. We've got two receivers each side, four Lundquist. First down before they cross the finish, the finish line if they can make it. They pitch to Nick Johnson who's just right grabbed by they got it sorted out. Here's the snap. Rosso looking deep. Going in the end zone. He's got separation on his man. Try to win. Formation he goes right up the gut. Second and forward. Just under three minutes to play. Wildcat again. Kurtz looking to get across the line. And he's going to be close to the first down anyway. Touchdown! The big boy gets it across. That touchdown was a sure lock. Dalton Lock, 56. You're not going to really stop some. It was actually Dalton Lock that was down. He. Scored the touchdown and just having some trouble getting back up. And so Duncan on the kick, the extra point. There's the kick, it's blocked and will not go over. this year. There's the kick, it is deep. Ball is grabbed by Braden McNary. Oh, and he hurdles a guy. Final very spread 4 2 defense for the Tigers. Lundquist throws in the middle, finds his receiver. That's number we expect anything less from these two teams, especially in the first game of the season. Lundquist rolls out. He's still looking, looking. Oh, he's down. So they got to hurry up. Two receivers to the right, fast and furious. There's the throw. Oh, the gear at the 49 yard line. Trying to crack midfield. Groden sideline. Defense is the call. And here comes the defense from. Oh, that's the play. I'm Kyle Stone, the 49. It's fourth and 13. This could be the biggest play of the night. Lundquist steps up in the pocket. He's got his man across. the left of Lundquist. Oh, and a false snap. Watch that snap. If it costs you a fraction of a second, so be it. So you don't get knocked down. So it's not first and 15. They go right up the middle. Another big catch. Big hit by Lucas Ward. He kept going. Yards after the catch. Oh, the the Nicely here. Kick the PAT. They got a victory. Five receivers. Here's the chance of the play. Oh, you gotta really hope he's got some good protection on that front line. Oh, they're going to the corner ends up for the jump pass. Oh, just in the play. Same five receiver set. One twist. Takes a snap. He's being chased in the backfield. He's gonna run for it. He's gonna try to pick up the first. He didn't quite make it. I get this one. You gotta have this one on defense film. does not face a more crucial moment in this ball game. Five receivers. Get it. To the end zone. Touchdown, Lundquist. Goes for 
Oh, the ball for the wall. This sucks. There it is. This could be it. Come on, make it. Gotta have it. It would be a Rob Tolley victory.